Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today in this Java GUI tutorial, we will learn about J progress bar in Java. So let's start. First I will open this uh, NetBeans and click on this file and click this new project and I will click Java application and click next. I will uncheck this create main class and I will name this uh, J progress. And now I'll hit finish to create the project. Now the project is created, so I'll close uh, this one. And now I'll expand this, and in this default package, I will create a new J frame form. And now I will call this J progress. And now I'll hit finish to create the form. Now I'll expand it or extend it on both side and now I will drag in a progress bar which is here. Now I'll make the size a bit bigger as well as the width also and now if I run this you will see an empty progress bar. You can see it. Now I will close it down and now I will right click on it and change its variable name to progress. Now how we can add progress into it. Now if I right click on this and go to properties and you can see that the minimum value of this uh, progress bar is uh, 0 and the maximum one is 100. You can change it as you want, as you need. Now I will close it down and uh, I will go to the source and here in this uh, J progress bar constructor I will create a thread called thread t is equal to new thread and here I'll put semicolon and now I'll create here new and control space and it will select runnable and if I hit enter again it will create the public wide run method for us. Now I'll remove this comment and this one line of code and now here I will write some code. I will write a for loop for int i is equal to 0 semicolon i is less than 100 semicolon i plus plus and now here I will put braces now progress dot set value now we will set the value to i and now we will sleep the thread sleep for 50 milliseconds now it is showing error so we will surrounded by try and catch now it is surrounded by try and catch now I will start the thread here t dot start semicolon and now what it is doing now when this loop start first it will uh, add the value 1 to this uh, progress bar and then it will sleep for 50 millisecond and then it will come again and then it will add 2 and similarly it will go to 100. Now if I run this you can see that the progress bar is running and progress is added into it. Now I will add numbers percentage into it 
by going into this uh, design and uh, right click on this go to properties and now here I will search for string label not string label but string painted yes it is here so I will check this and click close now you can see that a string is shown into it now I will again come to properties uh, you can access properties from here as well and uh, I will go to top and make this uh, bold the string and uh, make it 18 and click OK now if I run you will see that the percentage will also be running with it now if you want to make the progress bar a bit slow you can come to source and make this 50 as 500 and now if I run this now you can see that the progress bar is uh, running slowly because we have the uh, increase the sleep time for the thread so that's all for today I hope you like the video if you like the video please like subscribe and comment on my videos thank you